Hi, I'm Wokas Saeed, sales engineer at PASCO, and today we're going to be looking at PASCO's Ampere's Law experiment kit. The kit includes the Ampere's Law apparatus, wireless rotary motion sensor, sensor bracket, wireless magnetic field sensor, and a zero gauss chamber. We have our apparatus connected to a PASCO 850 interface. Uh, the interface is connected to Capstone on our computer. We're going to start by opening up the Ampere's Law experiment file that you can download from PASCO's website. In the file, we're going to go to the Data tab. And now we're going to click on Hardware Setup to connect our interfaces and sensors. Let's turn on the 850. We'll turn on the wireless rotary motion sensor and the magnetic field sensor. So we have to connect our Bluetooth sensors. Now they're connected. Before we attach the magnetic field sensor onto our bracket, we need to zero it out using our Gauss chamber. Let's click on Properties. We'll insert the probe into the zero Gauss chamber and click on Zero Sensor Now. Click OK. Next step, for the rotary motion sensor, we want to go to the properties and ensure that the linear measurement is set to large pulley with an O-ring. Let's click OK. And close the hardware setup tab. Uh, let's click on the calculator tab and ensure that our equation is here. N is equal to 500, which is the number of turns in the, in the coil on the apparatus. And our I is our output current that is being measured from our 850. On the signal generator, we want to make sure that we have a DC output with 15 volts and that it's set to auto. Let's begin the experiment. So let's connect our magnetic field sensor. So with this experiment, we need to go in a circle. It doesn't have to be a perfect circle. We just need to make one loop around and finish in the same place, in the same position as we started. Let's click record on capstone. And let's go in a circle. Now that we're finished, we click stop. And there you have it. Thank you.